Hi, this is Dr. Roy Steinbach, and today I'm going to teach you two breathing techniques. So breathing is obviously very important because it's the way we get oxygen into our body, and oxygen is sort of our main currency of energy, and we need this energy for our bodies to function properly. It's also really important for detox detoxification as well. In addition, breathing is also our connection between our conscious and subconscious mind. It's our connection to our parasympathetic nervous system, which is really important for healing, resting, and digesting. And so today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to teach you um, two techniques. One is called diaphragmatic or belly breathing, and it goes like this. So for diaphragmatic breathing, what you're going to do is you're going to put one hand on your chest and one hand on your belly, and you can do this either lying down or sitting up. Initially, it's actually easier to do a lying down because you'll feel a more dramatic response in your belly, but sitting up is really convenient for doing it at work or even if you're parked in your car. So what you're going to do is you're going to um, put one hand on your chest and one hand on your belly. And normally when we breathe, we often breathe into our chest, but what we're going to focus on here is actually breathing into our belly. So the diaphragm is actually a muscle that's at the bottom of our ribs. And when you take a brief breath in, it's contracting. And so this would increase the space in our belly as well as it's bringing air into our lungs. And when it's relaxing, it's also going to relax our belly as well. So, so try it with me here. So what you're going to do is, like I said, one hand on your chest, one hand on your belly. And when you breathe, you're going to really focus on trying to keep your chest still, but your belly extending as obvious as possible. So take a breath in and you're going to see your belly extend and then out. And you're going to see your belly fall. And again, in, extend the belly, and out. And you're going to try to keep your chest as still as possible. At first, this might be a little difficult, but eventually it becomes significantly easier. And this is really good for so many things. Um, it brings your attention towards your breathing and kind of have a single minded focus. In addition, um, it really kind of strengthens the diaphragm, so it's good for people who have reflux and it just has a really great relaxing response as well. The second technique I'm gonna teach you is called square breathing. And this is where you take in a deep breath and you count for four seconds. You breathe over the first four seconds and then you hold the breath for four seconds at the top and then you exhale for four seconds and then you hold again your breath for four seconds. So kind of like a square. And so practice this with me. So what you're gonna do is you're going to breathe in to three, four, hold your breath, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four. And you're just gonna repeat that cycle over and over again. And this is really helpful even if you just do it a handful of times. Um, the diaphragmatic breathing I'd suggest doing from like one to five minutes or even longer if you like. It's a great way to initiate meditation as well if you do it at the beginning of your other forms of meditation. So hopefully that was helpful, helpful for you.